Welcome to another video. Now we're testing DLSS 3 frame generation. So my first video here is Spider-Man's Miles Morales to test it and let me show you the, the settings. This is a quick test by the way. So here you can see that now we're able to enable uh, DLSS frame generation, DLSS 3. Here are all the settings. Here are all the current settings. Okay. The current settings. I'm going to start enabling this so that you will be able to compare the performance of a 4090 on Linux versus multiple type of videos that also did the same thing. So I'll do maybe 30 seconds without ray trace and with the settings as we have them, we have them here. And then I'll enable ray trace and then we'll increase uh, the object range. Basically, you'll be able to see all the testing. So by default, this is the default the current default okay so let's start with that and we can see the the, um, the fps there the 180 180 something can't let the underground of rock song fight here you think innocent people will get hurt you're not the first criminals to try something like this you could just talk this out in a public forum let's say like a city council meeting Okay, so we just had our first quick fight there, and you saw the average, um, 150 actually, something like that, whoa! Like I said, 150, whoa! Okay. Yeah. Okay. So 150, 160, something. It depends on where you are. So I'm trying to make it as tough as possible. Remember that the um, the typical tests is um, normally outside of heavy areas, which I've seen. I checked something here. You can see 190, 170. That, that's the common if you're something like outside um, a crowded area. Let's put it like this. Like here, you can see the jumps there. Like that. Now, let's enable. Basically, you can see compared to several Windows videos, we're getting really high FPS for the same areas. So I'm just gonna, I think, yeah, yeah, exactly. We can do very high, we can very high, I think. And let's just pump this all the way up there. Can this be very high? Nope. Okay, so I'm guessing that's that's it for that. I always disable this string, mainly for my eyes. Uh, can we do higher? Yep, okay. And I think that's it. So, okay, we got DLSS there. Let's see what's gonna happen. So it went down to, well, up here, it went down something like 30 FPS more. Let's just. Oh, 
Obviously the game looks stunning. You can see the DLSS there, basically real time there. Let's do another fight to see what happens with ray tracing. Where's the... Oh, it's up there. Whoops. You cased this place already. Are you kidding me right now? There's nothing in there is worth fighting Spider-Man. Come on. Robbing someone during the holidays? Not cool. Okay, so you can see an average of That'll teach it you not to do that again. Okay, let's say an average of 120. You know we're a little bit up, but just just average it down. Um and that's ray tracing with everything maxed. Normally you see other Windows videos that they only talk about this, they don't actually go here. Very important to actually go here because all this actually affects the. I mean, I could show you ray tracing, and you can see that right now we're getting. Let's just put in a worst case scenario. Can I do it like this? Okay, so just moving, we get between 120 and 135. Okay, and then I do like I show you a video of this, but then maybe I do this. Okay, and you can see a, a bump in there. So just take that into consideration. So anyway, showing you in a transparent way, everything full. Is this a, the highest? Oh, look at that. Um, yeah, you can see we've in one year of development work, Proton has actually gotten to the point where we actually have ray trace now, and now we got DLSS. Oh, right, and NVIDIA Reflex too. And we got DLSS, and we're using quality. We're not using performance or ultra performance or balance. No, no, no. we want to use quality. And even on quality, we get what you're seeing there. Okay. So hopefully you like the video as much as I like Spider-Man. And if you have any um, questions about the testing, by the way, I, I'm using, before you ask, um, Steam using uh, the Debian version right now and Proton Experimental because that's the one that has the, the DLSS 3. Obviously, I'm guessing Proton 10 or the new, the next version will have. This is my biggest um, fans. Hey guys. DLSS let me give you a right there. Love well. There's also, by the way, I forgot to mention. There's like a lower memory usage now with a with a Proton that I noticed there. And that's it. By the way, this is a this is both a GPU and a CPU performance affected game so right now I had to boost the CPU because it does affect the at least this specific game um, so that it behaves more like the Windows equi equivalent and yeah that's it that's all so I hope you like the video think positive and till the next video that I'll be also showing the LSS 3